Hi, and welcome to lesson one. Today we are going to teach you how to build simply sexy websites. Emily and I, Emmy, are here to make the process fun and easy for you. Before you begin, just like in any course, you do have to have a few things. You can't walk in completely empty. Um, one of them is an internet connection, of course. Hopefully you have one of those. If you don't, you're kind of S-O-L, as they say. <laughs> <laughs> you also need a topic, something that you want to put on the web, um, at least a general broad idea of what industry or concept you want to discuss. Uh, you're going to need approximately 10 to $20. Um, Hopefully you have that. It's way less expensive than almost anything else uh, we've ever found, so hopefully we're, we're giving you guys a hook up. great deal. And um, of course, as always, you need a good attitude. So let's get started. Okay. There are a few things that we want to teach you before we really get into the nitty gritty. Emily is going to go over a few of those things. If she forgets anything, I'll remind her and we'll gently. do <laughs> gently <laughs> remind her. Um, there's just a few things you need to know. So let's get started on that. Emily? There are really four concepts that you need to understand. One of them is, of course, the reason you're here, your website. But it's actually not the most important thing, believe it or not. Um, in many ways, uh, the other three things play a bigger role than that. Hmm. Uh, the first one is your traffic strategy. Of course, it doesn't matter how wonderful your website is. If you're the only one looking at it, it's only useful to you. The reason you're wanting it on the web is for other people to see it. So you need to find a way to get eyeballs on your site. Not the kind of traffic you're thinking about where you're sitting in traffic, but actually people going to your website. Exactly. So uh, there's lots of ways to do this. One of them is uh, banners, getting links out there. But one of the best ways to do it is through Google. Uh, we call this search engine optimization. And that is the strategy that we're going to be teaching in this course. The second thing you need to know is who your audience is. It's not very useful to try to sell work boots at a fashion show. Unless they're Marc Jacobs. Unless they're Marc Jacobs. And Jacob. then it's okay. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, so you need to have a general understanding of who it is that's coming to your site. What kind of a person is typing into Google the key phrases that are giving results that are sending you, them to you? Who are they? What's their demographics? What are they thinking about? What are they interested in? So if you choose a topic, topic that you're interested in, it might make it easier to understand your audience. Uh, of course, the third thing oh, okay. is your site. What we're going to be teaching in this course is how to build blogs, primarily because blogs and Google are in love. So if you really want to get ranked in Google, make a blog. The last thing that you need to know is your action message. It's wonderful that your customer is on your site or your audience is looking at your page. What is it that you want them to do? Are you wanting them to purchase something? Are you wanting to get their email address so you can correspond them with them via a different medium? Or are you just wanting to build awareness for a nonprofit? Whatever the reasons are, it doesn't help for a customer to land on your page and immediately leave the browser. You want them to do something on your site. Um, that is the action, and the message that you're sending is going to encourage them to take that action, thus action message. I like to think of the metaphor of a beach, and your website is like a beach, and your audience is the people that are coming to the beach. They own swimsuits. They're in their thongs and bikinis, and then what do you want them to do when they get to the beach? Do you want them to buy a s ice cream cone? Do you want them to buy towels? You know, you've got them there, you want to keep them there, you want to get them to keep coming back. Are you going to teach them how to surf? Are you going to teach them how to surf? What are you going to do? So these, this is sort of the metaphor. Think of your website as a, as a beach. Um, so we are going to, throughout this course, actually build a site along with you so that you have a very concrete understanding of how this is going to work. So we had to pick a topic. And our topic is meditation because we're both very zen and we like to be relaxed as much as possible. When I'm thinking about my audience, I like to think about, especially with my traffic strategy, what are they typing into Google? Obviously. Relaxation, meditation. Uh, med meditation courses. Um, you know, there's a lot of different things that you can discuss. Um, for y your homework tonight, 
pick two or three things that you think most of your customers are probably typing into Google, at least the type of people that you want on your site. Just brainstorm, write them all down in a notebook. Don't worry about it, don't, don't be too serious about it. Yes. And lesson two is tomorrow, so stay tuned. Stay tuned.